Wellington on Thursday will draw more than 38,000 fans. Uh, the Wellington fans are the Yet another of Wellington's frequent southerly squalls hit the capital just as David Bowie arrived this afternoon. Airport officials were disappointed when they heard minutes before the plane arrived that there was no David Bowie on the flight list. But then one of them clicked. Bowie's real name is David Jones. And sure enough, he was listed under that name. I certainly like New Zealand people. I've not really spent enough time in New Zealand to be able to get to know the country much better than just the occasional tour or whatever. I haven't really been out of the cities, and the cities are not really how I judge a country. I understand that tomorrow you are visiting, uh, you're going to be welcomed onto a Maori Marae, which for a... I think that's wonderful. Well, right. For an international star, that's something very unusual. It really is. You seem quite excited by it. I'm terribly honoured by it. I think it's wonderful. These concerts in New Zealand. Yes. Are you going to be introducing any new material here? Or? Um, material that was on uh, Scary Monsters and um, Let's Dance. I think I didn't do that in 78. Despite today's southerly, here at Athletic Park, the venue of Thursday night's first of two New Zealand concerts, the promoters are in top gear, confident of a change to finer weather by then.